If you need a visual representation of how successful vaccines have been throughout history, just look up the cases of any one of these nasty diseases, whether it's measles, mumps, rubella, whooping cough, diphtheria, tetanus, polio, what have you, and look to see how many cases there were before there was a widespread vaccine available. And guess what? You look at these charts, they all basically go like this, because when the vaccines came around, cases greatly diminished. We do not want to see a reversal of any one of these charts. What we're seeing right now is Florida pushing to be the only state to remove mandates on childhood vaccines. Working to end all vaccine mandates in Florida law. All of them. All of them. And this would unfortunately set the stage for less children to get those protective vaccines and for there to be a lot more illness that is preventable. You could simply look throughout history and look to see what these diseases did to children. We don't wanna have that ever come back. We know that vaccine mandates boost vaccination rates that prevents outbreaks. We also know that when people are not fully vaccinated or there's more exemptions, nasty diseases like measles can fly around like they currently are. That's why we wanna do everything we can to maintain that 95% vaccination rate for school-aged children. We are moving backwards and we're seeing outbreaks because of a less than optimal vaccination rate and removing the mandates in one state like Florida could potentially set off dominoes in the form of an infectious disease outbreak. You know, when parents are concerned about the risks of a specific vaccine, we really wanna make sure that we have open dialogue and we hear that risk, but we wanna make sure we talk to parents and we empower them to understand everything they need to know about the diseases that they're preventing. Part of the success of vaccines is the fact that the average parent has never heard of diphtheria or doesn't know anyone who currently has polio or the fact that none of us have smallpox because it's been eradicated. This is the success of vaccines that many people don't have to fear of these diseases in this country. So as a pediatrician, I want to see kids playing in the community. I wanna see kids going back to school, hanging out with their friends, playing in sporting teams, all of it. We wanna keep kids out of the hospital, out of ERs, out of doctor visits and healthy. And removing mandates on childhood vaccines threatens all of this.